The time column is about to drop down to its final section, sires. The winners shall be determined soon. At this rate, the three of them won't be enough to take down Jiren. <sighs> the Patara earrings might be our only chance against Jiren, at least until Goku can bring back Ultra Instinct. Good to see you, Jiren. I bet you weren't expecting me at all. Not one bit. The Patara Earrings. It seems you want to go down the same route as that other contestant. You know you can't win, yet you proceed with foolish persistence. Is that supposed to make you feel better? I'm gonna make this plain and simple. Universe 7 will be the one to win this tournament. Clearly that hasn't stuck into your head, so maybe my fist will do the job. Does that persistence make you feel better about yourself? 
Ooh, that's fighting talk. Come on, Jiren, open your eyes and see the big picture already. Let's see how you manage the power of a Saiyan god, of the two warriors you were destined to fear. I don't get it. Why wouldn't he just go blue and hit Jiren with all he's got? Timing. Super Saiyan God won't drain his timing, yet it'll still be sufficient to get Jiren to show his true colors. At the right moment, they'll be able to channel all their power into Jiren and unleash the final blow. After all, we only find out bit by bit what Jiren is truly capable of, and we won't have the time to see that. These damn Saiyans better know the amount of stress they're dumping on my head. If they both go out, we're doomed. I must say, this is a drastic change of events, at least under my very expectations. Who would have thought that we'd be able to see yet another fusion going against the Tournament of Power's greatest opponent? Or will he be the greatest for long? I wonder how these chain of events will unravel in good time. Contestant Vegito versus Contestant Jiren, both universes shiver at the very climatic result of this fight. Yeah. them attacking like this, they could win. Jiren's off his rhythm. He's making a mistake. I never imagined a mortal could be so sublime. Surely it's too much for even Jiren to take. He did it! Ah! After all his struggling against Jiren, now he has the upper hand. <sighs> to hell with your trust! Putting faith in such things would mean denying all that I've witnessed in my life up until now. I know better than to believe in that kind of so-called strength. You can spare me the sob story till you're out of the ring. 
Might makes right and might alone. Without strength, we have nothing! I know how easily it's ripped away! I'll show you! Like a firestorm! Jiren's energy is climbing even higher! Jiren's power level just completely exploded! How can this be? Damn it! about <laughs> what do you got to say to that seven jiren and his squad are just too much for you it's just a matter of time before you're wiped out strength will always be towered at the top and that strength will forever be mine the two of you fought well but the tournament is over Something for you to know, Jiren. The fight's only over when I say it's over. Gotta admit, though, you almost had me there. And you would have. But I've still got one goody good little trick for you. Check this out! coalesced a power within himself that is far beyond the Super Saiyan Blue level he has displayed in the tournament up to now. This is it. The breakthrough they've been searching for. Okay. What do you say we wrap this up? Contestant Vegeta of the 7th falls along with Contestant Jiren of the 11th. Both are eliminated. Wait, what about Goku? Didn't he fall with Vegeta? You may want to take a closer look, my lord. It all makes sense now. The power of Ascended Super Saiyan Blue was too much for the fusion. They merely had a minute at best. Whilst Vegito dragged Jiren to the bottom of the stage, Vegeta saved Goku at the last second they defused. Goku! Come 
on, get up, buddy! I will now make you suffer! The Hand of Justice has picked a target for elimination, Goku! And that target is you! No. This isn't over yet! You think you can stand against me when you're barely on your feet? Either way, I think it's safe to say that the winner of that fight between the two was Vegito. Take my justice? Right. Ah!